There is more than one method that can be used to construct a pentagon, and my method of choice is the method that uses Carlyle circles. To begin this construction using Carlyle circles, we start with a point, and we label it O, and we're going to construct a circle around point O. Since it doesn't matter what the radius is, I'm going to open this up just a little bit more to fill the screen, and I'm going to draw my circle. Next, I'm going to draw a horizontal line through the center of the circle. I'm going to mark the point of intersection here as point B. Next, I need to construct a vertical line through the center O. To do that, I'm going to need to construct the perpendicular bisector of the diameter. I will put the point of my compass here and here, and I will draw my intersecting arcs. Because I already have the center to use as one point of my line, I only need one set of intersecting arcs in order to draw my line. So I'm going to take my compass and put the point at point B. And we're going to make sure to open up our compass over halfway between the two endpoints of the diameter. I'm going to rotate my compass down and mark off arcs from both endpoints. Now I will draw the line through point O and the intersection of my two arcs to get the perpendicular line. I'm going to mark this top point of intersection as point A. Next I need to construct the midpoint of O and B. I'm going to take my compass, put the point at B, and make sure my compass is open over halfway between B and O. I will draw arcs above and below from both points. I will take my straight edge and I will draw my line. I'm just going to draw a short line because it's not really the line that I'm interested in, but it's the point of intersection. I'm going to label that point M. Next we need to construct a circle centered at point M and through point A. So I will put my compass at M and I will open my compass up so that it measures the distance from M to A. Now I will draw the circle. Where the circle intersects our horizontal line outside our original circle, we're going to label that as W. We're going to mark the point inside the circle here as point V. Next, we are going to construct a circle with radius OA, but the circle will be centered at point V. So I need to take my compass and measure the distance from O to A, and then move the point of my compass over to V and draw my circle. This circle intersects the original circle at two of the vertices of the pentagon, here and here. Now I need to draw another circle with radius OA, but this time it's going to be centered at W. Since my compass is already open to the length OA, I just put the point at W and draw my circle. This circle also intersects the original circle at two of the vertices of the pentagon, here and here. The fifth vertex is the intersection of the horizontal line with the original circle here. All that's left is for us to connect those five points using a straight edge. What you see in red is our pentagon. 